Hey, look at that. Look at that. I can do one of these. Hello. Hello, visuals. Hello, go away, visuals. Hello, visuals. Welcome back, visuals. Go away, visuals. Oh, no, come back. I'm in bed. Why don't you come join me in this room for one more? <laughs> <laughs> Yes, hello, visuals. It's the news. Welcome back. Where well, I'm on a bed. Yeah. All right. Welcome back. We had no lose. No, lose. We had no lose. <laughs> Does it mean I had no news last week, visuals? Because uh, why? Because I work and shit. I fucking hate work. Um. Um. But, but look, you can see the circumstances we're in now. Okay, visuals. Shit's gone a bit fucked because the new bed has arrived. I've assembled the new bed. It's soft. This bit here, I quite literally sleep just. It even has that soft noise, um, but it's left me in a bit of a uh, bit of a dilemma because the setup's all gone to shit. In my head, with my fucking stupid measurements, I thought, be alright, thick bed there, I'll have plenty of room down there, do vids here. I have a gap of about that big. So th this is, I'm, I'm, the chair is now the tripod holder, and uh, this is where we're at. Where the fuck is this? Where did that come from? Bear with me visuals, we're going to still do the news. Where's my news stories? Right there, right in front of me where I put that weird little thing. Um, hallelujah. The rolls are still stayed the same. You got to get your hot beverage, in my case it's coffee, or you got to get the soda. Stev, are you watching this one? Are you listening, mate? 30 year old man surrounded by epic epicness and stuffed animals. Not even 30, actually, I'm 29. Ha ha ha, jokes on you. You grow up. Imagine if, like, there is some sort of weird future where um, I, I am able to spawn children and they stumble across and they go, I wonder what my daddy was like. And they see this and I'm like, hey, kids, stay in school. You know what I mean? This line needs to end here. But anyway, the, the, the show, apart from last week, m must go on. New bed, less room, doesn't matter. Made a weird S noise there, like a whistle, like a whippet. Um, so visuals, are we ready to talk canoesy news? Are you been, have you, how have you been? Have you been okay? Heading to anybody new? Anybody new coming on being like, oh, I wonder what this is all about. Fucking fat idiot. Just, I, I get my Pokemon notepad and I write down some new stories about, oh, that's funny. And we talk about them and, and we, we just say, this is the news. And James, I'm sorry because you said... That you literally, you can't wait for the news every week and I must have let you down last week. I didn't mean to let you down. I'll put a, I'll put a notch on the bed for every no-no. Not, not in that way, James, you dirty bugger. But anyway, visual, so let's, how many times do I, do I come, up, come on and go, but anyway, but anyway, but anyway. And I still do some sort of weird side tantrum, tan, tan, tantrum roll on about nothing. I've been sat watching the, I'm, I'm in the middle of it now, the Dharma stuff. I look at myself and go, I'm a weird little bastard, you know, just minging. And then I, I'm watching this, I'm like, what the fuck? I mean, honestly, I recommend so much you go watch this Dharma thing. I'm about, what am I on? Where am I on? I'm going to pause. Where's my thing? Episode 7. He was fucked. I mean, we know he was fucked because the people he murdered, but he was fucked, fucked. It's one of the most insane people I have ever watched anything on. There's an episode titled something about the 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 good the good boys in a box or some shit like that. It's weird, but it's very good. Go watch it. Just don't kill people. Just this this is the good weird. That's that's the no no weird. He gets a notch on the bed. Sick fucking cunt. Anyway, the Pokemon. Uh, this quite literally is. Look how beautiful this. My new my new uh my new little diary. In fact, it's only got just the same repetitive Pokemon. I think it's the starters, Eevee, Mew, Meowth, and Pikachu. Just everywhere. Oh, there's a little bit else I'm missing. Oh, and Jigglypuff. How did I forget Jigglypuff? The visuals. <laughs> but, 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 but I'm, but I'm like Robin Shabotsky. Yeah, right, visuals. Man's 174 mile per hour sneeze blows wife's hair off. Are you taking the piss? So, there's a bloke sat there, oh, love, I'm going to sneeze. <laughs> Ding! Hair gone. Can you even... Because I know that you, you can sneeze very good. In fact, can I even make myself sneeze? Let's try I've tried this before, live on camera, didn't work. Usually you give your hair as a tickle. <coughs> 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 
Was that 170 miles, four miles per hour? I don't know, but imagine being sat there just chilling on a little, lovely day at the fucking, I don't know what job she's got, and she works at a laundrette. Oh, lovely day at the laundrette, and then, oh, I have a lovely day, cool man, hurt you, oh, bold. Imagine that, imagine being the kid watching this, I had a really good day at school, mummy and daddy, and then, what you, yeah, it's gone, mum, what the fuck? Sat there trying to eat your fucking them cans with the little sausages and beans in. Ooh, where's he going? Sneeze. Ah, oh, this, this one is just a misunderstanding. I can completely understand where he's coming from. But father of 23 kids only had sex at night because he thought sperm was asleep. That's right. So he thought, you know, through the day, like, hey, Hornet, I'm going to get me some up, 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 post. And she's like, oh, okay. And he's like, oh, hang on a sec. It's not night time. I can't give you that day until night because my spermies are awake right now. So he thought, that his sperm in his testicles uh, would only be awake during the day. Therefore, do it at night. They're asleep. You're not going to get anyone pregnant. But it took 23 times for him to sort of go, what's going on here? There's something strange. So when kid number four, five and six and seven popped out, he didn't think, must be the sperms, must be awake. So all oh, the time, he definitely, he, he just thought, oh, it's weird. Why, why do I keep having kids? I'm only, I'm only shagging at night, God. Why do I still keep getting people pregnant? They're asleep. The spermies don't sleep, pal. They, uh, they stay awake. Well, as far as, are they even awake? Like, this is weird. Are sperms animals? This is gonna, I don't understand, like, you see the picture of them and whatnot and the videos and shit. And, like, they're moving and everything. And they've got their little tail, the little tadpole. Are they little animals? Because it actually freaked me out for a little bit that they, they were living inside me somewhere. I thought my body was full of tadpoles. Do men do men produce the tadpoles? Am I a polywag? Am I a polyraff? Ah, sperm animal. I don't like it. I don't like it. Ugh, this is grossing me out. Gay lovers find out they were brothers. How awkward is that going to be? Imagine that. Oh my God, I met this lad last night. Oh, what's his name? Nigel. We went back to mine. Had a lovely bit of sword fighting and willy whacking i don't know how gay people do the business um and then a couple of years later oh yeah i'm still still together oh by the way uh my family's in town okay my family's in town oh well our families can all meet that the families come around they go hi uh you, you're my son hang on a sec you're my long lost son and you look at each other and go oh snap because that would be one of the most awkward awkward um, old oh, snap moments, anybody can ever like, imagine, imagine, imagine you've been hooking up with somebody. Well, I don't know if it actually, you know, if it was a one-off or whatever, just to find out, yeah, you guys are actually brothers. Because, I mean, it's not their fault. They didn't know. They had no idea. Um, but they did the dirty. Hi, dog. Dogs probably won't care because they're weird little fuckers, aren't you? There's boy dogs that come around here and they're, they're sat licking each other inside of each other's mouths. I'm like, if you want to be gay, guys, you'd be gay as long as you're not brothers. Here he is now. Don't show you. I thought he was going to show his little butt all off. What are you doing? Gay lovers turned out to be brothers. You could, oh my god, the song writes itself. The gay lovers, then they were brothers. <laughs> why Why are you coming in and being all peaceful and not kicking off? You. Why are you side eyeing me? <laughs> you alright, son? You have an eye bugger. I'm not going to touch that. That is gross. Sort your eye bugger out, pal. Okay, you weird little freak. Don't chew my finger ever again. Next, next story. <laughs> next story. Visuals, what have you got? <laughs> Due to a decrease in concrete sales, the girls... Oh, no, not concrete sales. I'm saying concrete because I work in concrete. This one's fucked. Due to a decrease in cookie sales, the Girl Scouts switched to a more aggressive uh, sales campaign. But look at the picture. Does that mean the SWAT team are coming round? So they go, oh, oh girls, we're not selling as many cookies. What are we going to do? Kick their fucking heads in. You can imagine now. They get, so the Girl Scouts aren't actually these, these lovely, innocent little girls just selling the cookies. Buy again, dog. Um, it, no, it's a bunch of men in, like, proper riot SWAT gear or whatever. Kicking you, you want the fucking cookies? Imagine they've got a gun to How many fucking boxes are they going to give me two? Chocolate chip. We've already got fucking white chocolate. I love the white chocolate. What the fuck? The Girl Scouts are getting ruthless. If you see a Girl Scout, please buy the cookies because they will fuck you up. Stay safe out there, kids. Okay? And anybody. Girl Scouts. Fucking people up. 
don't even really need to read the story because the picture sells itself. But <laughs> our normal people with mutant powers uh, among us, this kid claims to be to be the real Magneto. Basically, little kid put up spoon on his nose, it bounced and he went, fucking Magneto. It's like me, you know, I don't know. It's like when you went into a cold morning, you go, you can see your breath. I'm ice, man. Or I don't know. I, 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 I get hit by something and I don't bruise or whatever. Oh my God, I must be fucking the Hulk. Some shit. Oh, I don't fucking know. Put a bit of semen on your wrist, get it wet in the shower. And go, you get, gets the shrug effect. I'm not spying on one. But yeah, the little kids just sat there at the dinner table one day. It's like... That's exactly what's happened. That's exactly what's happened. No, sorry to be that. Because, I mean, I should be the person pushing for belief and saying, no, you could be whatever you want to be. But unfortunately, in this case, you can't be Magneto. He's a fictional character. I wish he was real, depending on what mood he's in. But, yeah, you're not Magneto. And then the final, the final story is one that I do not understand. I have absolutely no idea what the fuck this is going to mean. What colour are the wrong socks? Uh, I, what? Wrap your head around that. Wrap your foot around that one. Because what colour are the wrong socks? What does that even mean? So, okay, what colour are the wrong socks? So, is is there a right pair of socks to have? There's a right. There's a right sock, I, I guess technically maybe, and a left sock depending on the patterns. Like I've got superhero ones that you have a right foot and a left foot. But what colour? And so, like, if I wear a pair of green, no, oh, no, they're the wrong socks. Them, are they the wrong socks because they're green? But then, isn't that subjective? Somebody's actually put this out there as one of them billboards you see outside the fucking posty and whatnot. And be like, oh my god, what colour are the red socks? Vivian, Vivian, what, what colour are your socks blue? They're the wrong socks. What colour are the wrong socks? I don't know. Do you know? What even is this? We have a visual that was this week's edition of the news, but we're still going to round off with the sports and whoever wear this week. This ah oh, this week yeah this week it's all about pandas. Let's go to this week's sports. Sports, yeah, whatever. Fuck you. It's a game of uh, how how cute is that panda eating? Pandas uh, for whatever reason have popped up a lot more on my Instagram, hence why I'm using them. And I can sit and watch pandas for days, especially with the. I, I, I don't know what it is. I could. Wait, panda. So we're not coming to work today. Oh, you sick down there watching Panda. They're fucking adorable. But I, I win that sport because I could watch it all day. The weather. For this week's weather, I should have maybe put it as a sport, but fuck it, Panda with a ball. Just more epic, cute pandaness. This, this is how you get the girls, you see. You lure them in with this cute shit. You sit there and you go, Panda. So you'd walk up to any girl right now and be like, do you like pandas? Because I do. And that's it. Instant love. How adorable is all this? And finally for Dan's happy ending. It wasn't... Well, it was It was a happy ending for me because I found this very, very funny. And it was one of the funniest where you watch and you go, ha, oh, you know, shucksy doodles. Kind of like how people look at me and they go, oh, there's that Dan. Oh. Um, but it's panda falls. A Dan's happy ending. Yeah, look at the little bugger. Look at the bit of buggeroonie. The bugger rigger 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 Just little pandas. Just do, do, do. I watched um, a big eye video. It was, a big, it was like 20 minutes long. Of some, I think they were like a panda. They must have looked after them in a zoo or whatever. And the pandas were just going nuts. and trying to clear up all this stuff. And the pandas like, nah, get that back and give this back. And they just wrestle with the pandas like, oh my God, falling everywhere. They're like so docile and so amazing. I friggin' love them. There's panda falling. There we have it, visuals. Oh, that was this week's edition of the Visual Guy News. Hopefully you enjoyed. And uh, we'll get... We need to... We, we will work on something now. It must be a mega rearranged time. It's got to be because we need better... Well, to be fair, this is okay. I don't mind this. We can sit and have a chat. There's no different from sitting and having a chat there to sitting and having a chat here, really. Is there? I mean, the lighting's still good. And you can see some Pokemon cards and Cap Shield and you know, Stormbreaker over there. Um, You've got uh, Lego and Pokemon cards, I've already said Pokemon cards, you can Guardians and all that kind of shenanigans. Uh, so visual, thanks for watching. You guys are literally the fucking best. We're always keeping you and keep on, uh, keeping on. Da 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 da.
Mmm. <laughs> <laughs>